Beautiful snake, absolutely beautiful. I have got such a treat for you guys today. As some of you all know, I'm an ecological consultant in my real life, and uh, that means I get to go to sites and do surveys for protected animal species, which includes reptiles in the UK. Um, my highlight every year is finding grass snakes. It's our biggest reptile in the UK, our biggest native reptile, and I think they're beautiful and they're amazingly calm when you grab them and pick them up. They're completely uh, non-aggressive, which is why it's just so lovely to find them. And I've been waiting all year to find a big adult to show you guys. And I went to a site the other day and I found three. Finding those snakes has totally made my year. Uh, I absolutely adore reptiles. Reptiles were one of the first things I got when I first got into keeping different exotic pets. I had snakes and lizards and actually I did my PhD in lizard speciation so reptiles are in many ways my first love. Uh, so for me to find three big grass snakes in the wild and get to interact with them is huge. How's this for a grass snake? Beautiful adult. As you can see, they're not a huge snake, but this is quite a chunky one. That's out of the way. Unbelievably beautiful. Look at that stomach pattern. Amazing. Hoping people will find this video interesting because I get asked all the time how do you tell the difference between a grass snake and an adder. Not many people see grass snakes in the UK or adders for that matter so they're not really familiar with what they're looking for. Telling the difference is really simple. Grass snakes have a yellow collar around their neck which adders just don't have. Also grass snakes are longer and don't have the classic zigzag pattern down the back although when you see a snake disappearing into the undergrowth really quickly sometimes the two can be quite similar because the base color is quite similar but really if you see a grass snake look for the yellow collar can't go wrong that's it from me take care guys i'll see you next time mm -hmm.